good morning. We're going to make some people chow today and there's only four ingredients. That's right, only four. You need some confectionery sugar. You need a box of toasted rice cereal and you can get the name brand or the off brand. I got the off brand. And you need some chocolate chips, one bag. That would be 16 ounces. Now, I noticed on the chocolate chips, there's 10 ounces and there's 12 ounces. I couldn't find any 16, but I buy the big bag. And then you want some peanut butter, which is right here. Um, I ordered off Amazon Prime Grocery. I told you there'd be an upcoming video. And um, some M&Ms. So you want to start with clean hands. Always got to have those hands clean. You want to take this. What I'm going to do right off the get-go is I get the big, big bags at Dollar Tree. I think they're two and something gallons. 2.5, I think. Oh, I just put peanut butter on the side, but that's okay. You're gonna hurt a thing. So you wanna put that in, and that makes it that makes it perfect. I'll tell you exactly what size they are. They're called the jumbo 2.5 gallon right there. Jumbo 2.5. Don't want to start with messes now, do we? So what you want to do is you want a box of the Crispex. You want 12 ounces of chocolate chip. You want one cup of peanut butter, 16 ounces or 16 ounces of um, chocolate chip, and just a little dab of, um, they say a little cake of butter, which is about a tablespoon. So let me put this in here. Should have had that melted, but I wasn't thinking. Had a lot going on here this morning. When don't I have a lot going on this in the morning? My dad's been trying to call me, and I guess he forgot somehow. He's got the phone off the hook now, so I can't get a hold of him. Uh, I just love my parents. What would we do without them? Finally found my Grammy spoon that's been missing. Oh, praise God on that one. While we're waiting here, I am going to put it in, some of it, in this little tin, and I lined it with wax paper. Now we're just going to check it. And um, the rest of it I'm going to put in a container and give out as when I get my package together and um, get all my candies together. I've been making candies and all sorts of stuff. Never an end. I'm also going to show you the recipe. It's right here. So you can pause, still pause the camera. I'll see if I can get a still picture too as well. Ray gave me this recipe. One of his co-workers brought this in to him and said, Hey, Ray, I think Brenda would like to try this. So of course he brought it home and I made a double batch and he took it to work. Lucky him, huh? Let's see what's going on. Peanut butter is nice and soft. Oh yeah, it's coming along great. Oh yeah. And then you want to melt this all together. Then you want to pour this over the cereal. Once you pour it over the cereal and you get it coated nice, then you want to take the um, confectionery powder and put over that. Been having trouble with my um, Apple phone. So if you guys can help me out, that would be greatly appreciated. I, um, I have most storage space mostly stored up. 
But I also transferred my pictures. Well, I can't seem to delete my pictures off my phone, so it keeps my storage space full. So if anybody can tell me how to do that, I'd greatly appreciate it. So what you want to do now is you want to take this and just pour it in. Pour it all over. And what I like to do, put it back up like this, kind of watching my time too. Because if I go too far, my storage won't let me do anything. And then I just kind of roll it around, get that chocolate mixed in, just like this. Then we can put some more in. You also can put it in a big old bowl and you can stir it. But I find that the cereal breaks up a lot more if you do that. So I try not to do that. Okay. Get this. And the thing about having a great big bag is you have a lot more space to work with and you can twist and turn it all around. Oh, that chocolate's gonna get me sneezing here. Oh, it doesn't take much to get me sneezing a coffin nowadays. Oh, boy. Look at that. Look how nicely this is coming together. Like I said, having this big bag really makes a huge difference. Just like that. And this is so easy peasy to do. And it's really yummy eats. Let's not forget that. Okay. Some more here. Pat in. Love to try to keep my grandmother in the holiday spirits. Don't know what I'd do without my grandmother. Get all this chocolate out here or as much as we can let's put it that way okay I just call this like milking it down just milking it down the bag just like that mm. this is gonna be great just wonderful. Whoops. I don't want no messes. There. See how this is getting nice and coated? The bag gets nice and coated. And it gets it all over that cereal. Now I want to show you inside. Look at that. See how well coated that gets? And then what you're going to do is you're going to take your three cups of powdered sugar. And you're just going to put it in just like this. Just like this. And again, you can do it in a bowl. But I find it to be less messy to do it this way. And you've got more control when you're working with it. But that's up to you how you want to do it. There. And we're just going to get this all coated nice. And what I like to do is I like to dump my M&Ms in after I put it. Oh, I thought one fell out. I'm like, how'd that get out? After it goes in the container. Because... Some folks like M&M's and some don't. Some can have chocolate and some can't. Oh yeah, this is coming nice. Real nice. Just like you're being soft with some nice bread dough. Let's take a peek, see what we got. Oh. Yeah. Ah, oh, beautiful. Just look at that. So now I'm gonna scoop some out. I got a scoop here. A 
Look at that. And then I'm going to take some M&Ms. Just like that. And there you have it right there. Yummy people chow. Doesn't that look great? And I'm going to try one. Mmm. Try one, I try two. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. So if you like this video, give me thumbs up. You never know what's gonna be on my video. Puppy mix was today. So we'll see you tomorrow and have a great day. Bye now, God bless.